All right, so we're in this patient's knee here. Uh, this is the medial compartment. So right here is the medial femoral condyle. This is the medial tibial plateau. This is the medial meniscus. So this is the anterior horn here extending into the body. And then this goes into the posterior horn here. This patient has a tear of the root or the root attachment of the medial meniscus here. So this posterior horn here should be anchored down into the tibial plateau. And you can see she's torn the root attachment here of the meniscus, which makes it sort of flop up there in the breeze. Um, so in order to preserve her meniscus, we're gonna use a arthroscopic meniscal repair technique here where we drill tunnels through the tibia, pass sutures through the meniscus, and then pass them through the tibia here, tying onto the front of the tibia, which is going to securely uh, reattach her meniscus root here to the uh, native attachment on the tibial plateau. So this is a posterior root tear of the medial meniscus, which you can see very clearly right there. So this is us just roughening up the attachment here using this curved curette. This is just to stimulate some bone where we're going to do our um, repair stitch here, stimulate some bleeding so it re the, uh, the repair actually takes. Okay, let's get a curved shaver in here. This is our curved shaver, which allows us to get under there. So here we've got this self-retrieving suture pass. We've passed our first suture, which is the blue. Uh, and now we're passing our second suture here into the meniscus, right at the root. I think that's a good bite. So we'll turn our hands a little bit. You see it coming through there. It's gonna retrieve it. And then we just release and come back. And there's our second suture passed through the meniscus. So one and two. So we've passed our two stitchers and stitches and we've drilled through the tibia here. Now I'm going in with my grasper and uh, this is a monofilament that we pass up through the tibia. I'm gonna pull this out through our anteromedial portal and this is gonna allow us to transfer our two sutures. So here you can see that coming through. This is through our drill hole. I'm gonna take it out the same portal. Good, and now we've got a passing suture with our two sutures that's gonna allow us to pass these down through the tibia. Okay, so now we are going to shuttle our two sutures down. I've looped them through our monofilament here. And as you're, you're going to see here, you're going to see the monofilament with our four suture ends coming in, and this is going to pull them out through the tibia. So now I've got them on the anterior tibial cortex. We're going to keep going a little bit. Good, they're out. And then I'm going to take these individually now, starting with the whites and take out the slacks. So this is the whites going down, and then we're gonna take the blue here. That's the blue, whites again a little bit. Good. So that is our two sutures now coming out, and you can see how we've restored the tibial attachment there of the root, and that looks perfect, I would say. So here's our final product. Here's the body of the meniscus here. This is the uh, medial femoral condyle. Here's our blue suture, uh, which is tensioned through the horn and going down through our tunnel that we drilled there. Our white suture is in the back here, which you can't really see, but it's tensioned as well. And now if we sneak our probe underneath the meniscus and try and lift up, 
you can see that we've restored this root attachment here, uh, which has made our meniscus very, very stable. I'm unable to lift it off, uh, and that's going to heal down to the tibial plateau there and be very, very good for this patient, I think. Um, so that's a very, very uh, secure uh, root repair here done arthroscopically. Looks great.